Food safety can be defined as handling, preparing and storing food or drink in a way that best reduces the risk of consumers becoming sick from foodborne disease. The principles of food safety aim to prevent food from becoming contaminated and causing food poisoning. With this in mind, ensuring that food is safe for human consumption is likely the most critical part of the food preparation process. This ranges from what is called farm to fork, meaning from the farms all the way to your plate. This means that food safety is important at home, as well as in the restaurant, retail store or food factory. There has become an ever-increasing awareness of food safety by the general public, and news agencies are reporting on food recalls and outbreaks much more often. Reviewing the available stats, the CDC estimates that each year 48 million people get sick from a foodborne illness, 128,000 are hospitalized, and 3,000 die from food poisoning in the US each year. Food safety is clearly a global concern that covers a variety of different areas of everyday life. The principles of food safety aim to prevent food from becoming contaminated and causing food poisoning. Food safety can be achieved in five basic pillars. Proper cleaning and sanitizing of all surfaces, equipment and utensils. Maintaining a high level of personal hygiene, especially hand washing. Keeping foods cold when needed and keeping foods hot when required. Storing foods in a way that prevents cross-contamination and cooking, reheating and cooling of foods as well as the prevention of cross-contamination during the preparation process. Food safety is important for the following reasons. If food or drink is not safe to eat, you cannot eat or drink. The easiest example of this is safe drinking water. We would never drink water that did not come from a reputable source. The very same principle applies to food. Every day, people worldwide get sick from food or drink they consume. Bacteria, viruses and parasites found in food can cause food poisoning. There is no immediate way of telling if food is contaminated because you cannot see it, taste it or smell anything different from the norm. Food poisoning can lead to gastroenteritis and dehydration or even potentially even more serious health problems such as kidney failure and death. The risk is especially significant for those in the high risk category which includes small children or babies, pregnant moms, the elderly, immunocompromised, especially HIV infections, and cancer patients. So food hygiene and food safety prevent germs from multiplying in foods and reaching dangerous levels. Ensures daily healthy family living, keeping one healthy and preventing the additional cost of buying medication and medical checkups. This is especially important in business, where companies worldwide lose billions of dollars per year due to staff downtime. Hand washing accounts for 33% of all related food poisoning cases. It is therefore important to maintain good personal hygiene practices. This is something we are taught early in our childhood, yet hand washing is still a critical problem in the kitchen. Cross-contamination is a major cause of food poisoning and can transfer bacteria from one food to another, usually raw foods to -to ready-to-eat foods. Good food hygiene is therefore essential for food factories to make and sell food that is safe to eat.